at tactile cues to facilitate sit to stand. The very first thing you want to do is block the patient's foot from sliding. From here, you're going to gain control of the patient's knee by pinning it between your own. Next, you're going to grab a firm grasp above the patient's knee to activate their quads and scoop from behind their pelvis to get under their ischial tuberosities. From here, it will be a swooping motion where you'll then take your palm and place it in front of the patient's sternum and have a firm grasp behind their pelvis. All the while making sure to keep the patient's knee pinned between yours so that they do not buckle. From here, you have full control of the patient, no matter how wobbly they may be. To sit back down, you will simply reverse the order of your operation, uh, sitting the patient down and releasing when they're stable.